Two years ago, Lee Stiltner was an alcoholic living on the streets. Well, now he spends many days at work helping build streets in a Wilmore subdivision. LEX 18's Michael Burke explains how someone in his life made all the difference. Lee Stiltner knows exactly what he'd say to Officer Donovan Grider if ever given the chance. I don't know where I'd be if I hadn't ran into you. Um, you give the badge a good name. When they first met years ago, Stiltner was living on the same streets Grider is charged with protecting. Lee had been badly beaten by a couple of thugs, beaten by alcoholism, and beaten by life. I think he was afraid he may be getting arrested, and I was like, I'm not trying to arrest you, I'm going to get you some help. It worked as Lee has since sobered up, hasn't had a drink in 369 days. He's married now, and back in February, the couple welcomed a son. He's also operating the heavy machinery for ABR Construction, its full-time employment. Lee wanted better, and he saw the opportunity and took it. He took so many steps towards recovery and reinventing himself, but the most significant steps Lee has taken might have been those final few he took towards today's reunion. I, I really wanted to thank you, and I didn't, I didn't have any idea how to get a hold of you. <laughs> well, I'm glad you did. I'm glad to see him. I'm glad you're doing so good. That's... And he's glad Lee accepted the help. Lee is the person who made the choices to change his life. But Officer Grider helped him see that he had a choice. Public servants have a hard job, and it's a... Uh, it's a beautiful thing when you find one that really shines. For know. this making a difference. Really uh, make a difference in my life. I'm Michael Burke, LEX 18 News.